Do you want to add promotions to your booking widget? Res Diaries Promotions is an intuitive way of doing this, but is a much more powerful tool when combined with other functionality within the diary. This tutorial will cover the basic capabilities of promotions and serve as a springboard into more specific use cases, like sectioning off areas in the restaurant for events, running a promotional menu for a specific time, or taking deposits for large parties. Let's get started. Click Promote and in the Promotions section click Promotions and then Create a Promotion. There are several tabs across the top. First we will look at the Info tab. The only sections that have to be filled in here are the name of the promotion and the dates you want the promotion to appear on your widget or internally. If you want to start serving this promotion next month but allow bookings for it today, your start date should be today. If your promotion has a set price, you should fill it in here. It is useful to add a description for your customers, but not necessary. Cutoff time is the amount of hours in advance that a booking can be placed for this particular promotion. You may want to stop bookings 24 hours before if you're running a menu where you have to order in specialist ingredients. On the right are various rules that can be applied to the promotion, the number of people per booking, the total number of covers available in that service or day, you can take a deposit, which is covered in details in its own film linked in the descriptor. You can choose to take card details. Finally, you can choose to enable or disable the promotion here. This will make your promotion go live once you save the promotion. So make sure you are happy with this setting before saving. There are other functions here, but they are in development. In the area tab, you can select which areas are available to this promotion or if the promotion is only available to a specific area using the required toggle. You must select an option here before you can save the promotion. In the validity tab, you can select when the promotion is valid. You must add a validity period before you can save a promotion, whether it is a one-off promotion for a specific service or day or if it is an ongoing promotion that applies on specific days. Click Create Validity Period to open the pop-up and fill in the details for what dates the promotion is valid for, whether it is available for the full day or for a set period of time and which days of the week it is applicable to. The additional tabs give further control, allowing you to vary the amount of covers or price on a specific day, how many covers are available to each channel, or letting you change the length of time customers have on their table varied by promotion. The translation tab allows you to add the name and description text in a variety of languages. Once you're happy with your promotions, you can click save. You have created your promotion. Now you can test if it's working. Remember that this will be live for customers to see. So it's best to test at a time that customers are unlikely to be booking, like early morning or late at night. From your diary, click on Promote. From the online facilities, click Microsite. This will bring up a pop-up of your microsite. Complete a booking that will trigger your promotion. Make sure that it is working correctly. There are a variety of ways that promotions can be applied to get different kinds of effects. There are further tutorials exploring this linked in the descriptor. If you're having any issues or have any questions, you can find more information about promotions on the knowledge base or get support anytime by raising a ticket.